Hi, this is Jeffrey Rhodes from Experimental Homesteader, Exotic Gardening, and SherryAnnRichardson.com. Uh, I'm taking care of the vlog again. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, just finished work. Uh, we got out a little bit early today. Uh, well, well <laughs> actually, we still worked over a little bit, but we got out earlier than, you know, the 12 hours that we were uh, more or less expected to work today. Um, painted did not bring us as many parts as we uh, had been getting, so we finished up, and uh, we've got a little bit to work on tomorrow, but not too much, and uh, hopefully they won't bring us too much in the morning, so we'll be able to uh, get started and get through it fairly quick and have a decent Friday. Um, and I'm still needing to get my blood work done. Um, from my doctor appointment uh, last week um, and I finally called over to the hospital to double check hours and how long I need to fast for for my cholesterol check. Uh, the cholesterol check is 12 hours of no food, uh, you know, fasting. So that one's going to be, it's, it's going to be tough um, and there's definitely no way that I can do it during the week while I'm working. Uh, but the hospital lab is open 24 hours, um, so I'll probably take care of that on Saturday. Uh, I did find out that we do have to work Saturday. Uh, yay. Um, <laughs> so I may wait till Sunday, actually, to go in and do the, uh, the lab work. Um, that way, you know, I can, I can just go to bed and not, you know, when I get up in the morning, not have anything... Uh, right away and get my 12 hours in and then go get the blood work done um, but it you know I had to get to check and make sure of, of which labs were open when uh, the main hospital is the only one that's open uh, when I can actually get in there um, without possibly coming to work and not eating anything for lunch and going the entire day without any food uh, which would be really hard to get through the day doing that. So, um, but we are working Saturday. Um, and that's, you know, it's not voluntary on my part this time. We were mandated that we were coming in on Saturday and working eight hours. Um, so I'm not as exactly happy about it, but it happens. So, um. I think a big part of it is just the fact that it's coming up on the end of the month. We've got a lot of work that we have to get done uh, to uh, basically get our inventory taken care of, you know, end of month inventory, and close out the books on stuff. So, um, and I think uh, that when I get home, uh, I think there's some ribs that are uh, in the process of uh, cooking. So uh, I'm looking forward to uh, possibly having some nice, uh, I think we have pork short ribs. Uh, and uh, so I think it's going to be barbecue ribs, baked potatoes, and I'm not sure what kind of vegetable. Uh, we had Brussels sprouts last night, uh, so I'm not sure whether we'll have more again tonight. I ate the leftovers for my lunch today, so um, if we have more Brussels sprouts, it'll be the other bag worth of Brussels sprouts uh, <laughs> um, but it may be green beans or some corn or spinach um, I think we might also have some peas up in the cabinet so I'm not sure just what we might have um, I think we still have a little bit of le uh, lettuce for some salad yet so we might just do a salad um, but uh, I think it's gonna be a good dinner tonight and uh, We'll see what happens. Uh, I've got to work on getting the house uh, closed up for winter. Um, i got to get some plastic up on the windows, uh, get the other heaters turned on. Uh, it's supposed to be better tonight. It's not going to get as cold, uh, I think, for the next couple of nights, and then it drops back down again. So I've got to get stuff done in the next day or so uh, so that uh, we have a nice warm house. Uh, it was a little chilly last night. I did turn on a couple of heaters, but because I haven't um, gotten everything squared away um, as far as, as 
plastic over the windows and, and sealing some of the cracks and, and um, or the, the air loss areas. Um, it's still kind of cold in the house, so. But I'll get there. It'll be it'll be nice, um, and hopefully, uh, with the work that I did upstairs, with putting in new insulation up in the attic, um, it'll be warmer this winter. So, anyways, uh, give us a thumbs up, thumbs down, comments below. Uh, subscribe. Get your friends and family to subscribe. We are still trying to reach 5,000 subscribers. And uh, so I think that's going to do it for tonight. So we'll see you again tomorrow and have a great evening.